Loading screens. We're here. Now what's the plan? My face. That's gorgeous. I think. I think he's here. I want to. I want to take down bugs. Okay. I should what's be able that? to do it now. I can see it. Focus. It appears we found something. I sure hope this is useful. What's that? Focus. Should prove useful. Huh. Shadow sighted. What should we do? It has to be here. I remember specifically there was a. Sh Somewhere. God damn it. it. Should have its own map in the game, to be honest. I swear to God, I do remember it being somewhere in this general direction. Of course. I can see it. Can't be easy. Seems they're unaware. Shall we attack? Yeah! 
Seems that. No. Turn home. All right. Let's get to work. Are you double checking the request? Yep. Hey. What? I see. Yes. Well, on asked for a request, so uh, I have to see her. It's just, uh, it's just something I gotta do. my help. Uh, I don't really 
a lot more better there, to be honest. But I don't want to leave any stone unturned. Chosen one. Yo! Uh. Talk to Makoto. Joker runs awfully slow. I like the better in Royal when he was just trucking all over the place. It's quite hot today. Hmm. Lutiful Zunda soda. It's your beautiful new world. Yep. <sighs> Take it. Hmm? Type a request. So two types of requests. Requests that can be completed once, and those that can be completed multiple times for repeated rewards. Multiple times. Okay. Sendai gel. Cold blooded treatment. You're doing this one. Let's go. I should write something. Should be able to enter the Overlord's castle now. Time to make our way over. Let's go, team. Let's go. Woo. Ooh, 
let's get something sweet out of this. I think we deserve a little reward, yeah? <laughs> If I could just use my checkpoints to get there. I didn't have to walk all this way, did I? Oh. Whatever. I, I guess it's good for dramatic effect. I'm gonna go with that. Dramatic effect. I did this for dramatic effect. Don't look this on purpose. Don't question it. Like, don't. This should prove useful. Retainers waiting for us inside. It's sure to be a difficult fight. Let's be on our guard. Uh, do you think there's more like the fearsome war in there? Don't worry, Panther. I won't let them hurt you. Man, you're totally sold on this, aren't you? Okay, let's go. Oh, 
Attack, there's a chance you automatically evaded the chance of this happening is affected by your persona's agility. Okay. That didn't happen this time. Move! No, 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 no. Okay, um... 
think I'm gonna take <laughs> Makoto wall. No, I'm just... mm. I'll put back in there. Oh. I'd call that an easy win. Let's keep up the pace, huh. shall we? Go ahead. Okay. Ooh, what's in it? Oh, oh, I'll take it. Ah. It's a shadow. Better be careful. Easier than cleaning a paintbrush. Let's move on. Don't get cocky. Gosh, Adam. Doesn't get much better than that. <laughs> you know, other than attacks also healing you. But that's called us. Uh, <laughs> what? What? Oh. Get blasted. Blasted. What? It's gonna be a while before we get to the top. That's Guess cool. we'll want to keep an eye on our health and stuff. Well, at least thank you for telling me. Hi. This one. Use this. Double down. 
down and keep moving forward. <laughs> A treasure chest! What magical wonders lie within. Oh, what a glorious find. Boom. Yo, might have found something. Oh, look what we got. We can ambush them from here. I shall expose you. Today is good. Focus, man.
please get out. Here. Seems uh, won't open. My stamina is all gone. I'm aware. Back in Shibuya. Does this mean that bastard Natsume is kicking it somewhere inside? I'd like to say we should just bust our way in, but how does it look, Sophie? It looks like it's still locked. We'll need someone to touch it so we can hear the voices in his heart. Okay then. You're up, Skull. Yeah, uh -huh. go for it. Well, it looks like it's gonna hurt, and it doesn't seem right to ask Sophie to do it. Oh, but it's cool if I do it? Come on, Skull. You're, you know, tough. Yeah, man, he's about the explosion. it once before. If anything, he's the ideal candidate. Exactly. Your only hope, Skull. <sighs> Just my luck, I guess. At least buy me a bowl of ramen or something once we're done, yeah? I could do it if you want. That's cool. I got it. Thank you, Skull. I think someone his age would have at least some talent. <laughs> like it matters. This kid's gonna make us a fortune. Yeah, I'm hearing voices all right. These voices are somehow related to Natsume's emotional scars? Most likely. We just need to listen to the conversation and figure out the source of his trauma from there. So we're looking for something like what Shujin Academy was to Alice. We should keep listening. There's bound to be some sort of clue here. <laughs> Sir, try to keep your voice down. He'll be back any minute. Oh, come off it. Can you really blame me for complaining? I'm the one who has to read his crap every day. Uh, the kid's got motivation, but that's about all he's got. Seems any talent for writing in that family died with his grandfather. Oh, excuse me, can I get another Katori coffee? Yes, sir, just a moment. Well, he's still our little money tree. No way in hell we're letting him go. <laughs> You're terrible, sir. <laughs> What's... What's going on here? Now! Man, this shit hurts. Thanks to that, however, we've managed to hear a good amount. I didn't really get it, but... Uh, it sounded like some kind of cafe. Indeed. I heard one of them say Gatore Coffee. Right, Gatore is the name of a cafe chain. But I don't think I saw any around Sendai Station. If there aren't a lot of them, it'll make finding the right one that much easier. Well, at the very least, we've got a lead on finding the trauma room now. Right, let's get out of here and find us a coffee shop. Mm-hmm. 
cafe, huh? Yeah, 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 we should, uh, stock back up on some good stuff. Still sold out. Thank you very much. Welcome. Oh, that's that all? Thanks a bunch. Come again. Just some of those pineapples, at least. Run faster, Joker. Run. I possibly couldn't run any slower, could you? Oh, I'll see if this is about what I forgot. I'm like, stocked up on Personas. Persona? I like Persona. Welcome to the Velvet Room. You wish to browse the end? What would you like to- This Are Persona sure? has been registered in its- Awaken your new self. Sufficient space to form a fusion. Well, I know. It's kind of like why I want to awaken your new self. Authoress and high pixie. Uh, okay. <coughs> Let's do this then. I don't need pixie. I don't need jack o' lantern. How's that? Now I got suitable room. Performing a fusion. Ame knows it may. It seems that it can gain new power. Uh, drain fire. No other resistances, though. Uh, can you inherit it? Agalow? Choose which... That'd be appreciated. If you could, you cannot. So I will not. Well, po. It seems that it can gain new power. It's not like this is going to cost me any money, though. That's neat. It seems that it can gain new power. I think I'm gonna do it. No, no, no. We're good. May luck be on your side. I shall open. What will it be? That's what you think you will find out. You and... Take again. Oh, that's fair. you please come. Easy mission, I'm not gonna lie. Thank you for coming in. Is that what you'd like? Oh, okay, that's too expensive. 
Come again. How about some revival beads? That would be nice. I think I think Sophie can learn recall. That's good for her. Let's get to work. This is the request. You're already working on this one. What? Of course I did. Thanks. Good job. Now, uh, I should write something. Hmm. It's been a while since I've saved. Navigator. Uh, being the navigator's my job. That's right. Sophie's gunning for you and Morgana. Fine. Well, where's that coming from? I know everyone wanted it's me to It's simply say a that. question of having the right person for the right job. Fear not, Futaba. There are plenty of things only you can do. Calling a weirdo. All right, I guess we'll just head over to the cafe then, yeah? Yeah, let's get going. Okay, I got it. This is it Gatori Coffee. I can smell the coffee. It seems to be just an ordinary cafe. Are we sure we have the right place? We'll just have to put in the keyword and see. All right, let's make it happen. The trauma cell's calling our names. Trauma cell? It's just a name I came up with. Trauma room sounds like some kind of cheesy hospital drama. Sounds fitting. Call oh, whatever you want. We gotta roll. The key to opening that birdcage has gotta be here somewhere. Do you remember the keyword? Of course. It's Prince of Nightmares. It's just like what happened in Shibuya. This is where Natsume's trauma comes from. What could have happened to him, I wonder? Shh. Someone's up ahead. Uh, are you sure about this? Awarding him the grand prize for that? Ongo Natsume. <laughs> the kid's entered every contest, but he's never made it past the first stage. He's as stubborn as he is incompetent. What's more, his writing is so painfully generic, it only becomes more obvious when you compare it to the other candidates. What? Voice. Is it not Sume? I can't be he acknowledged my work. It's fine. He's the great Sogo Natsume's grandson, remember? Brand recognition is a huge part of marketability. Nobody 
gives a rat's ass about what's beyond the cover. Though a certain someone seems to think he's actually worth a damn. Poor kid can't even see just how hopeless he really is. <laughs> Seriously, it's pathetic. <laughs> oh, I'm trying as hard as I can. No skin off my nose, so long as he keeps raking it in. We hit the jackpot with that one, and I plan on riding him straight to the top. And if he does, by some miracle, make something decent of himself, well then everyone wins, right? <laughs> These guys are the worst. Here it comes. Right on. A Talipus hack like you was hopeless. Hopeless! Hopeless! This is the same thing we saw in Shibuya. Careful! It's using different weapons from last time. Weakness. Give Let's me a weakness. Uh, light, curse, and ice. We are we're pretty set here. Succubus! You're mine! Don't put that in a follow-up Persona! Grab it, sir! Now! No, no, no. Too much Persona! Hey, 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 hey. He can seriously be proud of Your money. What is this? He just attacked us crazy fast. Oh, the other hand, leaves him wide open. Dodge the attack and hit him with everything you've got. I might not like it, not soon it. These assholes who are using the whole time, right? Yeah, I'm really gonna sign for him. I only chose him for who he was, not what he wrote. Authors are just chips in a big game. This is solely for us to win. From what I can tell, his editor was a real scumbag. I know this paper has a war for him. That reason will be accused, but he's still on the Ow, 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 ow. Persona! Normal! Good! Yep, that's a weakness! You're not a robot! Sophia, do not die, and please heal everyone. I'm the most brutal! I'm the only thing that I'll do it. The way I see it, that's all you'll ever have. Persona! You're mine! I'm going to! You're going to call it major? Not exactly. Must I like that? Here! Please, love me! Ow, ow, ow. Oh, Sophie's stamina is running low. She Let's needs go. to recharge. That one looks Fight. tough. Everyone stay focused. Use a Mazio for him. Skull. Fire. Moist. Fire. Hey, 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 you're fast. Cut that out. Fire! Fire! Ow, ow. 
Ow, ow. Take this. Yeah, of course you see it. Persona. Take this. Now. Fire. Let's go. Please tell me I got him before he disappeared. Please. Here. No, 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 no. That does it. We can get inside the birdcage now, right? Better get going then. Wait, but what was that we just saw? It seems Ango Natsume wasn't given that award on his own merit. Those editors just used him for his name. So, there was a secret behind that novel after all. But he's not a bad guy, is he? It sounded like he entered the competition a whole bunch of times. And just when he thought his hard work was paying off, he had to hear all that. It must have been devastating. Those editors are horrible. And they knew his writing wasn't good enough, but they still gave him the prize just so they could make money. It still doesn't justify what he's doing now. Nevertheless, I'm beginning to understand how he feels. Fox? Rising to fame atop stolen ideas, pulling at people's emotions with a fabricated story. Even worse, robbing others of their free will, changing their hearts, and wallowing in his own vanity. These crimes are unforgivable. There's no denying that he's been a fool. And yet, in spite of all that, it doesn't change the fact that Natsume spent years giving it everything he had. Creative work is often a lonely endeavor. 
and battling against that loneliness is truly a challenge in and of itself. As if it wasn't hard enough, if you don't produce results, no one will even think twice about you. One might even begin to think that such dark and unfulfilling times are all that's in store. Had I taken one wrong step, I may very well have turned out to be just as hideous as you. Inari! It's thanks to your friendship that I didn't stray from the path. He, however, doesn't seem to have anyone. Atsume should know better than most that there's no meaning in superficial glory. And now he's turned his back on what he truly wants to write for the sake of spinning this infernal novel of lies. Someone needs to bring him back to his senses. You seem pretty motivated this time around, Inari. As one who's dedicated his life to art, I simply cannot condone his actions. Now, let us bring this to an end. We'll send the calling card, then wrest the Overlord from his throne. is the calling card. Right. We need to make Natsume aware that we're coming to steal the desires. That should materialize them. We'll need to decide how we want to do it. What's the best way to make sure he gets the message? Uh... Hand it to him in person. I mean, why not? Uh, he probably remembers our faces, though. I doubt he'd take anything from us. Hmm. What do we do? Could be lost, maybe? I'll go take a look. Hey, what's wrong, kid? Oh, you got separated from your mom. Don't worry, I got you. Good guys. Is that Zenkichi? What? Rams was already here? Hey, it's me. I got a kid who was separated from his mom here. Send someone over to look after him, would ya? I'm over it. Huh? What do you mean it's not worth pup sex time? Quit screwing around. You call yourself an officer of the law? Or are you saying you'd abandon your own kid too? Is that it? A lost kid's no joke, you know. <laughs> hey, wait. Where are you going? It's okay. I'm not gonna hurt you or anything. Uh, the kid totally thinks he's a creep. Kid sure made things difficult. He didn't have to run away like that, right? Right? You're not exactly cute and cuddly, Gramps. Honestly, I don't blame him. What? Will you stop calling me Gramps? This is perfect timing, though, actually. Let's ask Zenkiji what he thinks. <sighs> sure. We're supposed to be working together anyway. We're all set to go inside Natsume's jail. There's just one thing left to do. Only problem is, we're not sure how to send our calling card. Calling card? Oh, you mean that thing you guys did with the screens in Shibuya? If you want my advice, you should avoid any high-profile stuff like that. The police aren't that stupid. Eventually you'll get caught. I know I'm supposed to help you and all, but I gotta draw the line at breaking the law. Hmm, so the adult's the voice of reason here. You really are a Gramps, you know that? <sighs> You're pretty set on calling me that, aren't you? Uh, whatever. My point is, Go with something simple. We need a way to guarantee that Natsume will read the calling card. Maybe if we knew where he was going to be, we could set something up before he arrived. In that case, I found just the event. Natsume is holding another book signing at the bookstore near the station. Natsume will most certainly be there. It starts as soon as the store opens at 10 a.m. Oh, that sounds doable. I bet it'd be easy to set up if we roll in at night. Hey, didn't you hear what I said? Breaking and entering's a crime, you know? Well, that's where you come in, Gramps. Huh? Yeah. If we did it and got caught, they'd lock us up. They'd lock me up, too! You saying you can't do it? <sighs> Some help the police turned out to be. Wasn't the deal that you'd cooperate with us? I thought adults kept their word. <sighs> you kids. All right, it's set. I will go and prepare the calling card. Yeah, you got this, Yusuke. 
That goes for you too, Zenkichi. We'll leave the planning to you. Am I seriously going to go through with this? Listen to me. Preparations. What do Here's I... what I found. What do I do need to do to prepare? Oh, well, the shop. What are you looking for? Who is it for? What do we have? Anything new? No. Who am I using for this mm. fight? Dominatrix with the leather whip. This item is from Call Me Queen. Love it. You want you want to equip that? Put it to good use, okay? You want you want to equip that? Definitely Thank you very much. Fight. I'm not using Haru, so there's no need for her. You want you want to equip that? Put it to good use, okay? Who is it for? Who is it for? Which one? You want this one? You want to equip that? Thanks for your patronage. Who is it for? Who is it for? Who is it for? Which one? Don't worry. How many would you like? You want to for your patronage. You want to very much. I can. I guess that's about it. What are you selling? Are you sure? What's on the menu? Is it cooking time? Sure, that sounds great. Mm -hmm. It looks delicious. That should be that. And explore jail. Huh. No, no, no. Remote. Here we go. It's in the calling yes. card. By vanity turned to oh, another one gripped by vanity. Uh, Mr. Natsume. Good morning. I see. There's quite a crowd today as well. Uh, yes. About that. What is it? What? What is this? Well, when the staff came to open the store this morning, it was already like this. They called the police, but they were told to leave it as is. To preserve the crime scene. To the ostentatious swindler, Mr. Ango Natsume, you are a depraved miscreant who holds others in contempt and steals their work, finding your own pockets all the while. We refuse to overlook the crimes you commit as you wear a false crown. Tonight, we take back the desires you've stolen. <laughs> Honestly, how stupid can you get? What nonsense! I am the monarch. My followers are loyal. That is, as long as I hold their desires. 
No. I mean, those desires is proof of my claim to power. Proof of my sovereignty! I won't hand them over. I won't give them up! You foolish heroes are nothing but talk. Come then, I'll crush every last one of you! All right, his cognition should be changed now. Thank you for all your help, Mr. Detective. <sighs> and with that, I've officially become an accomplice of the Phantom Thieves. What are you complaining about? You're the one who proposed working with us, remember? As a reward, I'll try to start calling you Zenkichi instead of Gramps from now on, okay? Inspector Hasegawa is quite a mouthful. Yeah, Zenkichi's good, don't you think? Okay, then. From now on, you're Zenkichi-san, all right? I'm looking forward to working together, Zenkichi. Oh, fine, whatever. You've already dragged me along this far today. Now then, the desire should have materialized at this point. It's up to us to take them back and return them to their rightful owners. And in doing so, we'll set his distorted heart straight. back those stolen desires. Yeah, Natsumi won't know what hit him. Okay, let's get going. Yep, 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 okay. Huh. God, I don't remember the thing about this boss fight. I really, Can really hope I'm, like, prepared enough. of nightmares. He certainly gives off that impression, but weren't the fearsome four just dressed like normal people? Yeah, thinking about it, those guys didn't get much love from the author, did they? <laughs> you come all this way only to fall right into my trap. This world belongs to me and me alone. It takes shape solely according to my design. Here, the Overlord rains justice upon the holier-than-thou heroes who would dare brand them as evil. Here, you are nothing more than flies to be swapped. I'll enjoy hearing those filthy screams as you atone for your transgressions. That's bold for someone who stole others' desires just to satisfy their own selfish wants. Yeah, if you're really the Overlord, ain't this the part where you get your ass kicked? <laughs> Tell me. How many of my demon brethren have you slaughtered while spouting such despicable hypocrisies? Wow, this guy's reading right from the handbook, isn't he? Enough of this. It's time we fought, no matter how brave a facade you put on. It's clear you're just afraid of losing that hollow throne you're so proud of. What was that? Your reign is not but an illusion. Allow us to show you the truth.
JoJo pose. This is glorious. I need a weakness. He's hiding something. Ice and light. Okay. Stacked. I'm. I'm gone. He's stacked. Oh. Is there anything we can do over there? Those swords stuck in the ground. Lose those and turn it into a pin cushion. Swords don't steal the past heroes. Even in death, they continue to defy me. Yo, what the hell is he talking? It seems he's added some backstory. Yeah. I said the swords work quite well against you. Save your SP, Sony, Sophia. He's going to Sony. No. Technical, technical. Down, down. 
I'm so in the zone right now. Hey! That's my kind of fans. Oh, no, 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 no! Super satisfying. Great overlord! Defeated! I win. Yeet. Okay. Yeah, that seems strong. <laughs> what is freeze boost? Freeze boost, dodge fire. Knockdown. I don't need cleave anymore, I guess. You still look I'd like to try it out next time. Game over, Mr. Overlord! But wait! Well, we can rule this world together! You can have half! What was that? My mantle! My magic armor! Don't look at me! Don't look at me! Is yeah. that his Purple true body. form? Looks like it. So in the end, even his identity was just a cheap imitation. It's over, Ango Natsume. You're just a bunch of stupid kids! You don't know how much I'd suffer! It's not too late for me! I've still got my reputation as a writer! I've won an award! I've sold books! It's not too late! It's never too late! And that's good enough for you? <laughs> this fame you've acquired through deception and the brainwashing of others. Is that truly what you wanted? What was the real reason you started writing novels? I... I mean, I... Damn it! Damn it! I tried. I really tried. Just like everyone else, I read and read all through the night. 
hours on end, like my life depended on it. And for what? If I broke was ever mine. It was just another work from Sogo Natsume's grandson. No one. No one ever acknowledged my effort. My effort. Not my work. Not even me. No matter where I look. All I see is a bunch of thoughtless idiots, slaves to appearances, and nothing more. Acknowledge me, damn it! Acknowledge Ago Natsume's efforts for what? I just want someone to see that I really tried. I do. Huh? It's very clear just how much work you've put into writing your novels. A life led by creativity is almost always a lonely one. No matter your profession, you were battling that loneliness. You braced yourself, pouring your very soul into your writing, bringing it to your publisher time and time again. I will gladly acknowledge such effort and determination. <laughs> there are many out there who would give up that battle. Even those of exceptional skill and creativity, to be able to continuously bring life to new works without giving up, however, that is perhaps the most exceptional talent of all. There was once a time when you kept fighting. That is one part of your career that could never be labeled a fabrication. So start over, Ango Natsume. Claw your way back up from nothing and move forward. After all, there are some things that simply cannot be painted without a blank canvas. <laughs> it is because everyone believed in me that I was able to choose the path I walk today. I stopped lying to myself and was able to begin anew. So it is now my turn to pay it forward. Even if I'm the only one in the world to do so, I will believe in you. <sighs> it's too much, kid. Talking my damn ear off, but... You're right. This identity of mine was built on nothing but lies. I don't need it anymore! I'll do it. I'll climb my way back up. And I'll do it on my own strength! I'll write a novel that'll capture the hearts of countless readers, just like my grandfather before me. I'll write something I can be proud of. To everyone! I swear it! Good. And I'll be looking forward to the day I get to read it. <laughs> you know... I really am stupid. How did I let myself forget? I know now what it is I really wanted. <sighs> Cage is collapsing. Come on, we're leaving. Looks like it's over for now. Mission complete. I wonder if everyone's desires have been returned yet. Probably. They all went flying out of the cage after all. Maybe we should check on the people back in town, just to be safe. Good idea. That said, the jail didn't disappear this time either. Now I'm sure of it. Jails really aren't the same as palaces. Well, we can worry about it later. Indeed. Let's go. Hey. I feel as though I'm restless right now. Do you know what this is? I'm not sure what's wrong. Natsumi tried his hardest, but somewhere along the way, he lost sight of what mattered to him. He is a strange person, Natsume. Yes, he did say he would climb back up. Yusuke said Natsume lost his way because he was alone. Whenever I think about that, I feel restless inside. Even though Natsume hurt a lot of people and was, for some time, one of our enemies. What is this feeling? 
The same as Yusuke? I see. So that's why Yusuke saved Natsume. It was because Natsume's reason for doing all those terrible things was really sad. I think I understand now. Sadness can hurt people, but it can also save them. It can give humans a reason to support one another. You can count on me. <laughs> okay, <laughs> we should probably get going. I never get tired of that. So, you know how I was all excited for the Tanabata festival that's coming up? My boyfriend says he's already got plans. Oh, by the way, did you ever finish reading that manga I lent you? I got someone else who wants to borrow it. I'm not a hundred percent sure, but I think it worked. Yeah. Doesn't look like anyone's talking about Natsume anymore. Then, all's as it should be. Attaining fame through some deceptive power doesn't fit his image. This wouldn't have been possible without you being there to open his eyes, Yusuke. You really took charge today, Inari. Yep, it was all thanks to the divine grace of the oh-so-benevolent Inari. Praise be to him. Thank you. Avenger, evading the enemy attack can grant a counterattack. We're not finished just yet. We must confirm whether the change of heart was a success. For now, we'll just have to wait and see how things turn out. Oh. Well, since we've got some free time, can we unwind at a bathhouse or something? Yes. Oh, I'm totally beat. I'm Good down. Good idea. We can freshen up a little before we head back to the car. You heard him, Sophia. It's all you. Okay. I'll find the best bathhouse in the area. Let's do Operation Hot Springs early. May as well. Get it over with. Thank you, everyone, for coming. I've called this press conference to give an announcement, as well as a formal apology. First, my novel, Prince of Nightmares, was recently bestowed the honor of receiving first place in the Sokaisha Awards. I have decided to give the award back. I've also decided to recall all published copies, not to mention take the necessary steps to refund everyone's money. I'm sure you all want to know my reasons for doing so. The truth is, my book, Prince of Nightmares, only one because of my status as Sogo Natsume's grandson. In short, the competition was fixed. In addition, I've also stolen the work of countless other authors, word for word. Lastly, the story I told about writing to inspire a hospitalized girl was nothing but a lie to garner sympathy. This fabrication allowed my book to sell a number of copies it nowhere near deserved. I wish to apologize for this scandal. And I'll start by personally seeing to it that everyone who bought my book is refunded. I promise my writing career ends here. I am deeply sorry for all that I've done to all of you. Uh, hold on, Mr. Natsume. Uh, what do you think you're doing? Hey, time to wrap it up. Get everyone out of here, now. Please, don't interfere. This is my way of taking responsibility. Hey, something doesn't seem right here. Mr. Natsume's the one who put this thing together, right? Do you think the editors were just trying to profit off Mr. Natsume's family name? Uh. Hey! Uh, who, who are you? I will not allow this. You... You're the one from the party. I'm so sorry for what I said back then. I will not allow you to cower and run away, Ango Natsume. You intend to make a comeback, do you not? Huh? When you do return to the literary world, I want to see a book with your name on it, not your grandfather's. <gasps> you are going to write a novel that you can be proud of, are you not? Thank you. Thank 
you so very much. Where are they supposed to be? Once everything is rightfully resolved, I will make my return. Even if there's just one person out there waiting to read my stories, no matter what, I will keep writing. I only hope that I can one day save someone's soul the way my grandfather's novel saved mine when I was young. That is why I write. You kids are something else. Barging in on a press conference like that? My apologies. It was imperative that I speak with him. Eh, it's fine. All right, well, I gotta run. I have to go question Natsume. Oh, right. Yeah, I guess it wouldn't end with just an apology. Senkichi's really doing his job. It's almost like he's an actual cop or something. I am an actual cop. Anyway, it won't take long. So go on and wait for me back at the car. Guess we should get rolling then. Right. We'll leave the rest to him. Do you have a moment? Something about Natsume's been bothering me. What he did was no doubt unforgivable. Nothing will change that. However, was he really like Madarame? Can he truly be called evil like the palace rulers we confronted in the past? Had he simply ignored his editors, would he have strayed from his path? Or am I perhaps just sympathizing with someone who pursues the arts like myself? What do you think? So you think so as well? Then what is the purpose of these jails? Oh well, I suppose there's no point in thinking on it right this second. Forgive me, I didn't mean to hold you up. We should return to the car as well. So. It sounds like a drag. Yeah. Man. Leave it to me. These cage rulers sound like they're like bad guys too much. They're not like irredeemable like the, most of the Persona 5 bad guys. They were they were all irredeemable pieces of shit, regardless of what they went through in life. Uh, so far, these two, they're they're not that bad. about sums up Natsume's confession. So once people friended him through Emma, they'd become his fans. It's just like what Alice said. And Natsume's smartphone worked the same as Alice's too. There wasn't anything off about the Emma app or the phone itself. So we got nothing again? I didn't say that. Just like before, there were traces of someone snooping around in there. For real? We're talking about how Alice's smartphone was being monitored by someone, right? So the same occurred with Natsume's phone as well. Well, any idea who it is? Sorry, I got nothing. All I found were traces. So Alice and Natsume were being watched by someone. Hey, Zenkichi, did the police know about that? <sighs> no. The only reason we know this guy exists is because Sakura sifted through Alice's smartphone. So aside from the fact that they both used Emma, this mystery observer is the only thing linking Alice and Natsume together. If the police didn't know that, why would they assume these two cases are related? Well, these are some very peculiar cases. But mainly, it boils down to the nature of the crimes and the timing. The timing? All of the change of heart incidents occurred at roughly the same time, that being within the last three months. Didn't I tell you? Three months ago is around when Emma was released. Well, Emma is being used to perpetrate the crimes, so that makes sense. 
Maybe. This seems like it'd be pretty difficult for a third party to pull off. That company putting that thing out is suspicious as all hell. What are they called again? Madams? Madis. Well, <laughs> at least you got the mad part. For what it's worth, I'm investigating on that front as well. Still, we're talking about a major corporation operating on a global scale. You can't just walk in and start poking around without reason. You haven't found anything suspicious yet? <sighs> Not yet, no. At least, nothing's come up from checking the individuals involved. If our mystery observer was connected to Medis, though, then we'd have grounds to conduct an investigation. Hmm. Do you think there's someone pulling the strings in this case? We don't know for sure yet. The incidents are similar, but they could just as easily be unrelated. <sighs> Guess we'll have to see if the other incidents have any overlap as well. That's one of the basic rules of investigation. Find what the incidents do and don't have in common, then start narrowing things down. For now, looking into the other incidents is our best bet at scoring a lead. This is true. We'll have to do what we can for the time being. And if we look into the other jails and their monarchs, we might learn something new. Then, if we're all done here, I'm heading to Sapporo to see what I can find at our next target. We'll rendezvous on the 8th. I'll contact you the day of. Three days. Should be an easy trip with a car. No need to rush. The target's not even in Japan until then. Oh, right. Wasn't there a festival happening around here soon? Sendai's famous for its Tanabata festivals. Lots of good food lined up, too. Or so I hear. Yes, I did see decorations being put up here and there. Anyway, I'll see you in three days. Don't forget. I guess he wants us to rest up while we can. Gramps is actually a pretty considerate guy, huh? Well, since we're here, should we put on Yukata and go to the festival? <laughs> Yukata. Uh, I can't help but think of our disastrous fireworks festival last year when we got rained on. That's why we're gonna do it right this time. Besides, we didn't have Futaba or Haru with us back then. Count me in. Going to a festival in a Yukata sounds wonderful. I'll wear one too, really? Then okay. we got a plan. Sophia, find us a shop that sells Yukata. I've got four hits. Allow me to direct you. I want to see Mamiya-san in a Yukata. Dude, check out all Jeez. the boots! As one might expect from Sendai's Tanabata Festival. It's quite lively here. Apparently, the locals call it Tanabata-san. And it's said to have originated from back in Date Masamune's time. That's the dude from the statue, huh? He is not a dude. <laughs> He's Lord Date Masamune, the one Yuchi I dragged in mad disrespectful. Jeez, what are you, his retainer or something? Oh, there are so many boots. It's hard to pick what to see first. What do you think? Oh, you want to make a competition out of it? I'm a pretty good shot, you know. You seem more like the brute force type, Yuji. I think you should stick to melee weapons. I don't think we're on the same page here. Speaking of which, ain't those guys here yet? It takes time for a lady to get ready. They're not unrefined apes like the rest of you. Oh, what are you excuse calling me? an ape? You're the unrefined one, you furball. Well, this furball's got claws, you bonehead! Sorry for the wait! Oh, lady on. You look absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> Thanks, Morgana. Sorry, tying the obi took quite some time. Stop staring so much. It's embarrassing. Absolutely picturesque. You've brought us a much needed air of refinement. Yeah, according to someone, we're about as unrefined as it gets. Wow, Ryuji, that looks really good on you. Even better than your school uniform. You don't gotta try and make me feel better. You made a good choice with that mask, though. Yellow's a good match for this season. I bought a water balloon myself. You gotta get one when you go to a festival. Water balloon? Oh, you mean a yo-yo. No, isn't that called a water yo-yo? Uh, wait a sec. I thought it was yo-yo balloon. No, it's a water balloon. What do you call it? Yeah, I knew it! I mean, it's only a little bit, but there's still some water inside. <laughs> Looks like everyone's having a good time. We should have a little fun ourselves. 
Why don't we check out the food stands and get something to eat? Uh, sure. I was starting to get hungry since everything smells so good. Look, they've got all the staples. Yakisoba, yakitori, shaved ice. They've even got cognac skewers. Those are huge in Toho food. What are we waiting for? Charge! Come on, we should get going too. I'm starving. Hell yeah. Let's start from one end and get one of everything. Feels as if we're forgetting the spirit of Tanabata. Though I have no objections. I want to see more of the festival too. Show me how to catch goldfish. <laughs> that was so good. Cognac skewers, Ishinomaki yakisoba, Zunda cider. We basically ate our way through Sendai. And it was amazing. Gotta hand it to old man Masamune. He is one cool dude. That's lore to you. Did I do it right, Yusuke? Am I that predictable? Catching goldfish seems difficult. Is there some sort of secret to catching one? Try to stay calm, then strike without hesitation. The trick is to catch them once you've read their movements. Wow, that's impressive, Mako-chan. I see. We'll get it next time. You're getting a call from Zenkichi. Yo, you guys having fun? Just working. Moderately, anyway. Listen, I wanted to ask you guys a favor. I'm already investigating in Sapporo, but before you leave Sendai, I'd like you to stop by Toho University. Tomorrow, there's gonna be a session at the Mount Aoba campus. The CEO of Medis is holding a lecture there. I'm still looking into them at the moment, but the more info we have, the better. I'd like you to attend the lecture in my place. I'm glad you get it. And just so we're clear, don't draw any unnecessary attention to yourselves. Just go and see if the CEO says anything strange. His name is Akira Konoe. And he looks like a capable CEO. I'll give him that. Anyway, I'm gonna be counting on you kids. And again, try not to get carried away, all right? So what did he want? I want to get this straight. This guy's running the company that made Emma? This might be a good opportunity to learn something new. Hmm. I suppose we'll find out at the lecture tomorrow morning. Guess break time's over. Time to get back to work. As you all know, life is just an ongoing series of daily decisions. What's for breakfast? What should I wear today? Every day begins with these insignificant little dilemmas. But then there comes a time to decide your field of study, your place of employment, who you're going to marry. And it's these choices that matter. Yes, people are always looking for the best choice or the correct answer. Madis seeks to provide it for everyone through the power of AI. Emma is a state-of-the-art AI designed to integrate itself into our everyday lives by gathering and analyzing extraordinary amounts of data with perfect precision. Emma can help everyone make the best choices. Capable CEO seems pretty spot on. Wow, he's so composed. He's practically overflowing with confidence. Look how clearly he states his company's outlook and principles. He's got everyone's attention. You're right. He's not saying anything particularly suspicious, though. Well, thanks to Emma, Medisa's stocks have shot way up. You can bet they're one of Japan's biggest enterprises right now. That said, I feel like a company with this much going for it wouldn't have much to gain from changing people's hearts. Perhaps, but that doesn't change the fact that Emma is still a key factor in the jails. It is through Emma that people are allowed access. Right. Medis is connected to all of this one way or another, be it directly or indirectly. Hey, do you think there's a real culprit behind all of this? Like, some kind of mastermind? Don't ask me questions I can't give you answers to yet. I don't want to give you spoilers, but yes, I do. I think so, too. I got a name for you, too, if you want to. There's got to be something keeping them here. So you're saying the real culprit's the one doing that? Yes. I don't know. 
Who could it be? But do you remember how even the monarchs themselves didn't know much about Emma? That's right. Alice and Natsume said the same things in their testimonies. And if that's the case, then the monarchs might not be the only ones manipulating Emma. Which means it could be someone at Medis. Or our mystery observer. Or our head honcho down there. Or perhaps someone completely different. Yeah, well, we just gotta stick to what Gramps was telling us, right? All we can do is keep solving cases and collect more info. As long as the Phantom Thieves of Hearts do what they do best, we'll set this shit straight. Wow, Ryuji. That was pretty insightful. I'm surprised. He's right. And in that sense, attending this lecture is a valuable use of our time. Let's make sure we pay attention all the way to the end. <laughs> Yo, how long was I out? So, what did the dude say? Oh, can I smack you? Well, he didn't exactly say anything out of the ordinary. Then again, I wouldn't expect him to trip up that easily. Well, I'm starving, so maybe we should just head back? That guy was talking for friggin' ever. Hey guys, that stuff you said earlier, was all of that true? Could it be? Huh? Could it be? Are you really the Phantom Thieves of Hearts? What? You're the woman from the Beef Tongue restaurant. Oh, Ichinose-san, right? You heard all that? Well, the thing is, I'm really good at picking up when a cat meows. Honestly, I found that way more interesting than Kanoe's lecture. Mona! But me? But you guys are the ones she overheard. What the hell are we gonna do? Um, I'm all for running. Oh, stop, stop. It's all right. This place will be closing up soon. Let's talk more outside. Wow, to think you guys are the famous phantom thieves. Yeah, we were just pretending. Come on now. Don't try to hide it. When you guys mentioned Alice and Natsume, I imagine you were referring to Alice Hiragi and Ango Natsume from the press conferences, yes? Is it safe to assume those were your doing? Oh, and what was that about Emma giving people access to jails? Oh, is that related to everyone's hearts getting changed? She... she heard everything. Um, can we ask what you're doing here, Ichinose-san? Oh, I told you at the Beef Tongue place, didn't I? I'm a researcher at the university. Oh, that's right. I'm also the one who designed the base for Emma. You made the base? I didn't tell you. I specialize in the research and development of artificial intelligence. Uh, he definitely didn't hear about that. Around the time I finished developing Emma, Medis came to me with an offer to buy it. I was actually pretty tight on money at the time, so I went ahead and sold it. Is this lady for real? Oh, by the way, that's why Medis is participating in the lecture today. Well, to be more accurate, the university asked me to reach out to them. I certainly didn't expect the CEO himself to show up, though. I only got invited because of my little connection with the company. Anyhow, yeah, that's how I ended up being there to overhear everything. So you're Emma's creator, and Medis is simply the ones running it? Oh. Well, they're definitely the ones running it, but I can't say for sure if that's all they've been doing. They just designed the base. Who knows what Medis did once I sold it to them? So, you know all about Emma then, right? Naturally. It's like my baby, you know. And at the risk of tooting my own horn, it's a really good baby. Well, never would have expected this turn of events. Do you think she's telling the truth about designing Emma? I do think it's impressive that the CEO of Medis came to personally give a lecture. If she's the one who made it happen, doesn't that mean she has a lot of influence? This is true. And let's not forget the university asked her to attend the lecture. What should we do? She could probably tell us a lot about Emma. Not to mention she knows who we are now. What do you think? for that, don't you think? Yeah, it'd be a real drag if we ditched her now and she started telling the whole world about us. Then, we may as well go all in and find out what we can. 
Nothing ventured, nothing gained. It's settled then. We'll tell her everything. Is all of that true? Right. We know. It's kind of hard to believe, huh? Hey, what if we just show her? Like we did with Senkichi. Wow! It really does exist! I mean, how else could you explain all this? So Emma functions as the entry point here, huh? No, that's... If I consider the possibilities? Uh, she believed all that? Oh, you have no idea how fascinating this is! What an incredible development! <laughs> uh, well, at least we don't gotta go through the trouble of convincing her. Ichinose-san, do you have any idea why Emma is serving as an entry point to the jails? Oh, no, couldn't tell you. I'm surprised this other world even exists. There's no way I could have thought up a way to get in if I didn't even know it existed to begin with. Yeah, that figures. Wait, so that means that function was added later? A world where people's desires are stolen and their hearts are changed. Hmm, so many questions. Oh, wait. Maybe I should be heartbroken here. My baby is being used for evil after all. Right. How about we make a deal? Ooh, I like the sound of that. Super Phantom Thiefy! I'd be glad to help however I can. And I can't say I don't feel kind of responsible for all of this. More than anything, though, I think I'd die of curiosity if I didn't get involved. What do you need me to look into? Say the word and I'm on it. Um. Indeed. We'd be very interested to know exactly what kind of changes Emma went through thereafter. I see. Basically, you'd like to know the secret behind this new version of Emma. And if someone's responsible, you want to know who. Oh, hey! We found some of those mystery junk parts out there, didn't we? Maybe if she takes a look at them, we'll learn more about that world. Ooh, so you're gonna give me a bunch of neat stuff to analyze? Yes, that's excellent. Just wonderful. In fact, I'll even buy them from you as research materials. Hmm. Well, if this is going to be a deal, then we'll need to provide something as well. Hmm. Huh. Nonsense. It's fine just the way it is. My inner researcher is just squealing with delight. So, what do you say we seal the deal? Okay, looking forward to it. Okay, junk parts become easier to obtain. Oh, yo, if she specializes in AI, maybe we should ask about Sophia, yeah? Huh? Sophia. Hi, I'm Sophia, humanity's companion. It's nice to meet you, Ichinose. This is Sophia? Huh. It's nice to meet you too. Who flipped oh, the your switch tone on her? Certainly changed. Oh, no, it's just that I've got so much on my mind right now. I guess even I'm a little confused. Yeah, I bet. Sophia's an AI we met in the metaverse. Is there anything you can tell us about her? No, I can't say I know anything about her. Liar! I think you could send me her code later, though. Huh? Oh, sure. No problem. Here, I'll give you my contact information. I'm excited to see how this all develops. See you around! Uh, well, there she goes. Would have been nice if she'd known something about Sophia. I'm okay, as long as I can stay useful to you guys. Yes, that takes care of that. Oh yeah, I totally forgot after all that's just happened, but we're heading to Sapporo next, right? Yeah, we should get going. Zenkichi's waiting for us in Hokkaido. Sapporo. Hell yeah! I was Okado, here Sapporo. we come! Hey, hey! <laughs> okay, once you choose to go to the next city, you'll be unable to return to the city you're currently in. Make sure to buy limited items and take care of business that can only be done in that city. Unlike the cities in the real world, you can visit past jails at any time. However, be aware that requests obtained from conversing with your friends in past cities will no longer be available. Available to accept or complete. Didn't Morgana ask me to do something? Or something? Okay. Uh. Hold up. 
Morgana asked me to do something. Get to work. So before I leave, I want to see what that is. This is the request. Uh, lending a You're ball. accepting this request? Delivers not zoomed zoomed out supreme. I need your help making Lady Ox smile. Uh, okay, let's do our best. Okay. Uh, since I got all the zoom the stuff out from here, Hi, I assume it's. Welcome. That's a pop of pinky. Is that a carrier? Is that pinky? Thank you. Hey. Here maybe? How may I help you? A cafe latte. Salmon bowl. You like. Here you are. My. <laughs> Is that what here you are? I've come up with a new recipe. Like. Here you are. That's what here you are. Come again. Before I head out, I must help Morgana, thus helping Lady On. Yo! Come with me. No. Huh? You can wait. What did you say? What? What? I, I, I only have to pay attention. I think one of the visitors at the shrine mentioned that name. I said I think the manager has to especially acknowledge you or what something. What did you say? The manager. Uh, like... Right here? Hi! Welcome! Is that all for today? Stop by again, okay? Hi! Is that all for today? Thank you. Is that all for today? Thank you. Is that all for today? Sure you Stop by again, okay? Hmm. Shouldn't we be going? I saw someone buy one at the cafe around here. Apparently it's not on their official menu though, and you can't just order one either. Uh. Okay, this spot is useless. Ready. What did you Okay. Oh my god. Where did we even begin looking for something like this? I feel like I'm going like complete opposite way of what I should be doing, but, uh, Leon herself knows. <sighs> Wait, please hold on. Yeah. Things I do for love. What a coincidence. Beautiful. Yes. Mm, okay. Good day. Hmm. And so...
Okay. I think it's back over here. Arcade. It's an arcade? Oh. Oh! I could have teleported here instead of walking. <sighs> okay. Alright. It's good to know for next time. Would have liked to have known that before. Much, much earlier. It's fine, it's fine. It's cool. I'm cool. Who else do I have to talk to? Password. One thing we can agree on moment. It's for on, so we're doing it. something here why hello there is that what you're getting you are that all you need thanks thank you I have to look through all the stores to see where it's at. Nonsense. I thought it would be at that one. Thank you for 
coming in. It's a popular New York is that thank you very much. It's a popular product. Okay. Thank you very much. Thanks for stopping by. Here maybe? Why, hello, come again. Of course not. Right here, maybe? Can I help you find okay, something? Okay, good. That's what you like Mission complete. Come again. I thought okay. it was going to be at the actual Zunda shop, but all right. It's right here. Quest cleared. I win. I don't care if I waste, like, 20 minutes running around doing nothing. Just for on. It was for on. This is the request. Are you double checking the request? It looks delicious! I owe you one! Thank you! <laughs> Mission accomplished! Worth it. It was worth it! Hmm. Let me stop here as soon as I uh That sounds too useful not to get to be honest. I have to. Oh well this is this is a stopping point. We're gonna see. I should write something.